The high ho silver lining star died in hospital on Tuesday following a battle with meningitis, his management confirmed. The news of his death was announced on his official Twitter page. In view of the musician's 157,000 followers the statement read, on behalf of his family, it is with deep and profound sadness that we share the news of Jeff Beck's passing. After suddenly contracting bacterial meningitis, he peacefully passed away yesterday. His family ask for privacy while they process this tremendous loss. Celebrities and social media users have flocked to comment on the sad news, as many people offered their condolences to the legendary musician. Kiss frontman Paul Stanley wrote, Wow! What awful news! Jeff Beck, one of the all-time guitar masters has died. From the Yard Birds and the Jeff Beck group on, he blazed a trail impossible to follow. Play on now and forever. Piers Morgan called him one of the greatest guitarists in rock history. Spandau Ballet's Gary Kemp wrote, an absolute god of guitar. No one can replace him. From rock to soul to jazz he was the greatest player in all genres. Unique. Such awful news but thank you Jeff for all you gave us. Black Sabbath founding member and guitarist Tony Iommi said, I was totally shocked to hear the very sad news of Jeff Beck's passing. Jeff was such a nice person and an outstanding iconic, genius guitar player, there will never be another Jeff Beck. His playing was very special and distinctively brilliant. He will be missed. Prince of Darkness Ozzy Osbourne added, I can't express how saddened I am to hear of Jeff Beck's passing. What a terrible loss for his family, friends and his many fans. It was such an honor to have known Jeff and an incredible honor to have had him play on my most recent album, Patient No. 9. Long live Jeff Beck. The Kinks founding member Dave Davis wrote, I'm heartbroken. He looked in fine shape to me. Playing great he was in great shape. I'm shocked and bewildered. Deepest sympathy to his wife friends close ones. I'm bewildered, Jeff Beck, it don't make sense, I don't get it. He was a good friend and a great guitar player. Twitter user, Stephen Bishop penned, My condolences to Jeff Beck's family, friends and fans. He was a phenomenal guitar player. Jeff Brugger tweeted, Sending my sincere condolences to his family and friends. Jeff was a true guitar legend and inspiration to many players. He'll be missed. Rest easy sir. Lazerbez remarked, so sad. What a man, what a guitarist, what a legend among giants. Thank you for your music. Speaking when he was inducted to the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame for the second time in 2009, Beck said, I play the way I do because it allows me to come up with the sickest sounds possible. That's the point now, isn't it? I don't care about the rules. In fact, if I don't break the rules at least 10 times in every song, then I'm not doing my job properly. Inducted into Rock's Hall of Fame twice, Beck's music career spanned an astonishing 50 years. Forming the Jeff Beck Group in 1967, the guitarist created an alliance of rock royalty boasting Rod Stewart, Ronnie Wood and drum icon Cozy Powell as members. He would go on to perform with Eric Clapton and blues guitar god Stevie Ray Vaughan. Born Jeffrey Arnold Beck in Wallington, Surrey, 
The musician fell in love with rock and roll as a child, and built his first guitar as a teenager. The guy next door said, he'll build you a solid body guitar for five pounds, he later told Rockseller magazine. Five pounds, which to me was 500 back then, so, I went ahead and did it, myself. The first one I built was in 1956, because Elvis was out, and everything that you heard about pop music was guitar. And then I got fascinated. I'm sure the same goes for lots of people. Following a short stint at Wimbledon Art College, he left to play with shock rocker screaming Lord Such and the Tridents. When Eric Clapton left the Yardbirds in 1965, Beck joined the group and he went on to play on hits like Him a Man and Shapes of Things. He would later form the Jeff Beck Group in 1967 alongside rock royalty Sir Rod Stewart, Ronnie Wood and drum icon Cozy Powell as members. Beck recently completed a tour supporting 18, his album with Johnny Depp. The English guitarist was an eight-time Grammy winner, earning his first seven for instrumental performances and his eighth in 2009 for his work on Herbie Hancock's studio album The Imagine Project. Beck married Sandra in 2005 and had lived in Waterst, East Sussex, until his death.